Hello, hello, hello. Florence Devereaux is another one who probably does not need an introduction, but here it is nonetheless. She joined Wikipedia in February 2002. That's right, more than 20 years ago. Prior to Wikimania, prior to Wikimedia, prior to any meetup, in fact. She notes that because of this, she is an archaeology piece. Florence is also the former chair of the Wikimedia Foundation's Board of Trustees. Florence. Hello. So I guess you hear me. Yes? OK, good. So thank you very much, Rosie, and thank you for the organizing committee for this very first Wiki Women's Summit. And uh, I would like to thank you all, both people in the room and people online as well. So what I would like to introduce today is a very ancient tradition of every single Wikimania. So that's something that runs a very long time ago, and uh, which is still live today, and that's the Wiki Women Lunch. So before I go into specifics, I just want to very quickly say this will take place on Friday in room 324 at uh, well, lunch, lunch time, so 12.15. And I would like to go a little bit in history to talk to you about what happened. So what happened uh, was already mentioned a little bit by Maria uh, early on. Uh, gender gap always, always existed in our communities. It runs very deep, and even if the situation is, I would say, better right now, um, it was quite tough the first few years. And back in 2006, somebody called Angela Bisley, who was then a board member at the Wikimedia Foundation board, decided to create a mailing list. And that very first mailing list was called the Wiki Chicks mailing list. For those of you who are not English speakers, chicks means women. Uh, and it was particularly used in the American world, uh, for example, for, by the Ubuntu women and the Linux women. So she thought creating a list would be an interesting thing to do. And what happened, and that was very radical at that time, is she decided to make it a closed mailing list. So only female. And guess what happened? It really raised a lot of energy, lots of anger, lots of anxiety. We had people complaining, women complaining, because it was a closed list, but also many men complaining that this was too radical for our organization. So I can't remember exactly when this list was closed, but it was very quickly after the creation, just a few months later. And then a few months later, we had the third Wikimania event, which at that time took place in Taipei, Taiwan. And maybe you can show that image there. Was, were there some people at Taipei at the time? Yeah! We had three. So I would like to show you the very first image of the very first women's lunch, which took pay, place in Taipei. How many people on the picture? 12 people. So I'm sure there were more, because at least there were three of you. But at that time, that table was in the middle of a very big room with plenty of round tables. So we were women only, but some, lots of men around in other tables. And that very first lunch was called the Wiki Chicks Lunch. So it was not a Wiki Women at that time. And uh, you may recognize some of the people who are still around. So I am in, on the left-hand side. But there's also some people who are still here today at Wikimania. In particular, there's uh, Kat Walsh. So I don't know where she's exactly, if she's in the room. Um, and there's also uh, Phoebe Ayers, who was also a Wikimania organizer later. So she's on the right-hand side. I don't think any of the other people are still around, or at least not today. And uh, if you look at 12 o'clock, you will see Sue Gardner. So Sue Gardner just joined uh, the Wikimedia Foundation at that time as a first ED and gender gap was a very important thing to her so she really started working on that topic and that's after that meeting that we saw emerge all the initiatives that were earlier mentioned and that you are probably aware of so that's a very deep t very long time ago uh, this was in 27 and as you see we were 12 people so it followed in the following year we had 40 people in Gdansk, in Poland, in 2020, uh, 2010. 
and then we went to 60 people in 2014. That was in uh, London. So 60 people is quite a big. So I'm very curious to know how many people we will have this year. You will count for me for us. Uh, and the important thing is actually we were named the Wiki Chick Lunch till 2012. So it went for many years as the Wiki Chick Lunch until Washington when people decided to rename it and call it Wiki Women. I don't know who renamed it. I have no memory of that. Maybe it was a political decision because people thought that Chick was not so much a nice name for us, but that's what happened. Any, in any cases, let me give you some specific about this year Wiki, Chick, uh, mid, uh, Wiki Women Lunch. Sorry about that. Uh, some very important points. How, what does happen? So on Saturday at 12.15, you can grab lunch wherever lunch is proposed and you get to the room, which is room 324. Okay? Is there a dress code? No, no dress code. You come as you are, don't worry about that. However, since you will be with your plate, be super careful because you, if you've got your best clothes, maybe you might make a mess. So be careful. Um, you are here, but there will be other women by Saturday. So please, please be ambassador before lunch. If you go around and meet some other women, please invite them to join us. Okay? So be the ambassador of that. Some of you might be very busy people. So you might not have the time to spend the entire 90 minutes of lunch with us at the Wiki Lunch. So that's okay. Uh, we have a rule which is called the two feet, the two feet rule at on conferences. So that rule means whenever you need to leave, you leave. When you can come, you come. So just do that. If you have other obligations or other places you need to go to, that's fine. Just come whenever you can come. Now I have a very controversial statement and I'm sorry in advance about that, but that's very serious. This lunch is restricted to women, to only people who identify themselves as women. So people who, might, who identify themselves as men, sorry about that, but you stay out of the room. Please keep it a moment just for women. Um, but if you see somebody entering the room and you're not sure whether they are women or men, this is not up to you to really decide whether what they identify. So please leave it to the organizer to decide if it's an issue and they need to deal with it. So be nice, be gentle, be considerate with other joining, but just make the, the information known that it's for women. It's a space for us. Um, last point, which is quite important. What will happen during the lunch? Why are we gathering together? There are three reasons. The number one reason, if you look at the program, it's a very busy program in the afternoon. So you simply need to drink, to eat, and to gather energy so that you're very much awake in the afternoon. So that's the first goal. Second thing, there will be a photo, a group photo for women. That's how we know that there were uh, 12 attendees back in 2007, 60 attendees in, back in 2014. So there will be a picture. Same thing, if you don't want to be on the picture because you want your private life to be um, not seen online, that's fine. Just hide yourself behind somebody or do not join the picture. No problem, it's, there's no obligation there. And last point, um, we will not just stand and have lunch. If you want to stay silent and listen to others, do that. If you want to speak to your neighbor, just speak to your neighbor. But the tradition is usually that there are some people speaking up uh, they are not there to present themselves and to talk about their initiative and who they are and do a sort of a power trip. They are here to tell a story, to um, maybe inspire you. If they want to, to say something, they will do that. And if you are interested by doing that, think of your story in advance. And when the time is ready, then you can, you know, raise your hand and share a story with the others. So that's about it for the Wiki Women Lunch. And um, I can tell you in advance that I will have another meeting as well at that time, which is the Wikimania committee organizing team. So I might be there sometimes, but no, not the time. So it's the same for you. I will be happy to see you and uh, will be happy to see all of you join if you identify as women. Thank you very much.